What's going on, everybody? So, a lot of people think you have to send your letter certified mail, um, or they won't receive them, or whatever. That's a lie. Um, sending certified mail versus regular mail, there's two differences. Certified mail, <clears throat> it's gonna cost you four to five bucks. Regular mail is gonna cost you about 90 cents, 50 cents. Um, <laughs> certified mail, you will know when they receive it. Regular mail, you will not. The credit bureaus don't care about you knowing when they received it. If they don't have time to verify it, more than likely they're just gonna send you a letter back saying they verified it. Um, how are you to know whether they verified it or not? Um, so that being said, I'm no longer offering certified mail. And the reason is I spent over four hours at the post office this past weekend sending letters certified mail because a lot of you like certified mail. Now, I know a lot of you are going to say that's an issue or, you know, whatever. Um, the only other thing I can do is send the disputes to you and let you send them certified mail. Um, I just don't have enough time to spend every day to send everybody stuff certified mail. I promise you, whether you send a certified mail or not, they're getting your letters. Trust me. I never send mine certified mail personally. Um, and I've never had an issue with them not receiving it. Um, and another thing, uh, eventually I'm going to start charging for the consultation slash audit fee. Um, I don't want to rush into it. Um, I kind of feel like I'm selling myself short um, because everybody else I know that does credit repair, they have a consultation fee. Um, and a lot of them, the consultation fee is two to three times what the monthly fee is. So, I mean, I know a, a person, I'm not going to say their name. They charge $299 for the consultation fee and then $199 a month. That is a lot of money. I charge $125 a month, no consultation fee. Um, that is gonna change within the next month or two. Um, if you're a current client of mine, then obviously you won't have to pay that fee either way because you're already a client. Um, but your price will stay, this, will stay the same per month as well for as long as you use me. Uh, for example, and I'm not saying I'm gonna go up next month, but let's just say I decide to go up to 150 a month. Um, the people who are currently using me will pay 125. If I decide to go to 200 a month, they will still pay 125. Um, I'm also thinking about um, doing a one-time fee to work on your credit for 90 days. Um, I just haven't figured out how I wanna price that. Um, if you've only got like one or two items on your credit, you know, I guess maybe three max, um, and you don't wanna pay $125 a month, um, I will come up with a price to just type the letter up for you. And uh, that's something we can discuss on a call or an email. Um, whichever way you prefer to contact me. Um, but yeah, um, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments. You can call, text, email, call the office, leave a message. Um, I'm not there most of the time. Um, but yeah, if there's anything I can do to help y'all, just uh, call, text, or email me, and I'll do whatever I can to help you. Um, Y'all have a good day.